to say a big, big congratulations to Munmun because, like she said, I read Unhooked and I was hooked. <laughs> Only because, you know, um, as a girl, I think one has been through at least one of those many experiences that uh, the characters go through, especially uh, the protagonist herself. And uh, you see girls around you who are grappling with this all the time. I think especially girls in media, I take the, li the liberty to say that because uh, we don't get too much time to invest in our relationships. And the little that we get, you know, we're trying to make the most of it. And then, therefore, there's no patience. We're running out of patience. It's difficult. So I think I identified with it on a lot of these counts. And uh, I think it's just that, you know, it's, it's that point of identification. Every, every instance mentioned in this book will find a resonance with women somewhere or the other. Either you've gone through it or you've seen someone go through it or you've heard of someone having gone through something like that. So I think women are going to love it anyway. Girls are going to love it. And the boys, if you all want to know what we girls go through, <laughs> then you should just read it. I must also add that I was intrigued by the cover. I therefore thought that it probably had that that little some other quotient, <laughs> you know, the sex quotient that we look for a lot of times in bestsellers. I thought the cover really hinted at that. So I said, oh, let's see what this is about. But I turned to the, I turned inside and I saw Munmun's picture. And the cover and the inside picture didn't go together. So I was intrigued. <laughs> so I said, okay, let me read it. And I'm so happy I read it. I'm so happy I'm here. And please go get yourselves a copy of Unhooked First and then Hushed Voices if you haven't yet read it.